Welcome back to another weapon build video, and today we're gonna take a look at the Furious Prime. All right, Master Rain 12 weapon. This is the Prime version to the original Furious, and the original Furious is probably the lowest weakest weapon. It's a Master Rain 4 weapon, and comparing these two, the Furious Prime is looking way better than the original Furious. 5% crit chance, 2 times the crit multiplier, 12% status. The Aphirius Prime has 16% critical chance, 2 times the crit multiplier, and 30% status. So, yeah, the Aphirius is a major upgrade compared to the original. And also it comes with uh, ooh, 400 ammo maximum, 60 pickup, 12.5 fire rate, 80 magazine, 1.2 reload speed pretty much damn near the same thing on the Aphirus, but it has a 240 ammo maximum. And, yeah. I mean, the ammo maximum on this one is just way higher, so a lot of things are way higher. You know, the damage completely better. Now I'm gonna show you how to build the Aphirus Prime. Starting off with the Galvanized Diffusion, 110% multi-shot on kill, 30% multi-shot for 20 seconds, stacks up to four times. We got Galvanized Shot, 80% status chance on kill, 40% direct damage per status type effect in the target for 14 seconds, stacks with the three times. So really two amazing Galvanized mods that definitely need on the build. These are going to help you do a lot more damage. We got Lethal Torrent, always need to be on the build, 60% fire rate and multi-shot. And as you can see, our um, fire rate just went up by 20. Jolt and Pistol Pestilence, one is Toxin and the other one is Electricity, both 60% status, so lots, uh, a lot of focus on status here, of course, but this build is going to be a little bit different for you guys, so with this one, starting off with the three mods that are going to be adding here is first, the expel mods, so any faction you're going up against, go ahead and throw those mods in there, um, they're going to help you with a lot of damage as well, especially for that particular target. That is going to help you focus on damage on that. So with this one, the second mod I'm going to add in here, we're going to focus on a little bit of crit here. So let's go ahead and throw on the Creeping Bullseye, 200% critical chance, but decreases our fire rate by 20%. So don't even worry about that. I think our fire rate was at 15, if I'm not mistaken. It was at, oh, it was actually 12.5, and then it got dropped to 17.5 due, due, uh, due to the Lethal Torrent mod. So, we're actually really good. We're, we're really doing good with fire rate here. So, it was a bit slower at 12.5, but we're actually really good with fire rate right now. So, this weapon hasn't really affected at all, like, with fire rate. So, that's good. And then the next mod is going to help us out with Creeping Bullseye, backing it up with some crit over here. Crit Multiplier. Prime Target Cracker is going to increase our critical damage. 110% of course, so that's uh, another thing that's going to be just helping us out here, especially with the crit. It's not looking bad, so, you know, it is what it is, and I just think that we can leave it where it is right now. I mean, we have a lot of status. Now we got crit multiplier, and now we got critical chance, so there's a lot of things that's going to be backing up this build right here, um, and everything just relies on everything up top, really. Now, damage-wise, damage does suck, but like I said, everything up top, like this stuff, it's really going to mostly just be the main focus, be the main help, all right? And we do have corrosive damage in here. Um, so the Arcane that we're going to be using, we're going to be using Secondary Deadhead. This will give you rank 5 on Precision Headshot Kill, 120% damage for 24 seconds, stacks up to 3 times. 30% to a headshot multiplier, which is really good. This is going to apply way more damage on headshots. And then negative 50% weapon recoil. So that is going to be an amazing uh, thing right there about secondary deadhead. Just applying more headshot multipliers. Doing so much more damage when you get those headshots in. So now let's go ahead and see what this bad boy can do. And as you can see, 
Good damage. Like I said, our fire rate, our fire rate is so freaking good right now. This is why it's doing the most insane damage it is right now. On top of that, all the good mods that we have on this, the fire rate, it just made it so much freaking better. Ten times better. This is what um, I like about a Furious. Um, other, I would say other fire rate weapon mods, or sorry, not mods, but fire rate weapons, they are pretty great, right? Now, I don't know what it is, but it's like every time I go to use those weapons, they're not as great as the Aphiris turned out to be. And even though the Aphiris is a not too great of a weapon, not too bad, not too great. This weapon is pretty great to take to the still path. Probably not survival base at all. But it's not all that bad in the still path, of course. Um, but this weapon should mostly mainly be a base of Grenier. For sure. I mean, corrosive damage. If you want to add viral, go right ahead. But I don't think it would be that any effective. As much as corrosive will be. Especially towards uh, Grenier. For sure. Not unless you're using something like heat and um but yeah just all that stuff basically just heat that'll probably be the main thing that i would say okay go ahead and take that up against corrupted or maybe even corpus a little bit but mainly grenier kind of faction i would use this weapon against but yeah especially like if you want to take it up against higher level enemies i would say yeah it's mainly going to be Grenier base with a corrosive build, you know? So, let me know what you guys think about this build and the weapon in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Follow me on all social medias and Twitch. Links are in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching. Click the next video to see more amazing content by me. And I'll catch you guys in the next video.